and the, the last step in the process is building out objections. Now, objections, we, we all face a lot of the same objections. What is this in regards to? I'm not interested. Just send me some information. We already use somebody. Now, applying this to, to well, uh, let me just say this. To your crawl or walk stage will be just that you are prepared for these standard objections out of the out of the gate. And so if you get there or if you're if, if you're not there already, if you get to that stage, you made it you'll make a huge improvement. Now to get running you is creating uh in terms of the crawl walk run, the run stage will be for you to have identify maybe some of the custom objections that you might face and those could be uh, specific to different buyer personas. So if CFO might give you uh certain objections a an IT VP might give you different objections. Uh, a manufacturing company might give you different objections than a state and local agency. Now the good news is is that out of the gate, we are going to produce a lot of, Sales Scripter will provide you with a bunch of objection responses because as I pointed out already, you can use your pain points and your pre-qualifying questions as great objection responses and also your value statement. So we're, the software is going to plug all those in for the standard objections. But what you could do is you could identify any special responses for those different buyers. And so Sales Scripter will take you through a process where you can kind of edit, create objections and objection responses. The end result is something like this. It's what we call an objections map, which is a document that lists out objections and provides you with responses. Again, using something like this will immediately improve your results. This is one way that you can sort of access the information. We also display it in this other uh, format, which is what we call an interactive script. This is sort of a script that you can have up when you're making calls and it kind of puts everything in one sort of pain of view and you only see what you need to say next and you can access voicemail scripts from this uh, interface you also on the right side are your objection responses I'm sorry are the objections that you might face and you click on one of the buttons and you can see a response to that objection now when you're building this, this comes standard set up with the standard objections but if you do get it to a sophisticated place where you have your objections that you you want to be ready for for one buyer persona and then you want uh, to have your objections ready for another buyer persona you can you can customize it to where these buttons are all unique for each different campaign and when you flip from one to another that those change on the side and so that you're then you're ready to go